ile yote tunajua ni stories za jaba rape na ni stories za jaba because if you are raped for sure you don't come and report it on media What's up good people? Welcome back to SPM Buzz. My name is Shiko Gitao. We are right here at uh, Zandani Street. We have Truth Watchdog. Ebu tuambie kwanza ni shughuli gani imekuleta huku sababu hii street tunajua tuna mtu mmoja. Hii street, ah hii street tuna mitigi na wase wengi sana kwenye game. Na sana sana nikikuja hapa nimekuja kunywa kahawa. Kunywa kahawa ukitafuta next victim. Ah nikitafuta. Nikitafuta next Uh, naweza muita aje next next guest <laughs> sio victim huyo sio victim <laughs> victim ni wale amekosea eh tupe tupe ile introduce sorry je introduce oh kwa SPM birds yes. ya yeah, ladies and gentlemen kama kike kama kawa truth watch dog hapo hivi na letiaga ukweli kadao kipendo na mezo kikataa tuna kumezesha kwani iko nini na daily basis niko na ka evidence ukweli hujaitemwa kila siku una evidence Lazima. Let me, let me ask you uh truth watch dog like yes. life yako uko angaje now with carrying all these evidences at times do you feel like say tuko tunakuona uko hapa nje do, do you at times feel insecure maybe from stories you've done before Yes you, you you always have to feel like that but that shouldn't give you actually that should boost you should give you energy that there is an effect mm -hmm. of whatever I'm doing mm -hmm. So yeah kuna kale ka uoga wakati mwingine lakini niseme nashukuru sana mm -hmm. uh, serikali na nikisema serikali ni kwamba nimepewa security kidogo tu lakini at least inakupatia ile courage ya kuendelea kufanya kitu tunafanya security umepewa na serikali ya Kenya security ni ya serikali ya Kenya uh -huh. sio private lakini kuna watu private pia wako na sitaki kutaja majina uh -huh. lakini kuna kampuni za ambazo ni private wakati natokea kwa my events uh -huh. utaniona na wasi sio mimi nalipa wasi uh -huh. Yeah. Ebu tuambie labda truth. Uh, do you remember any incidents probably yenye ushai feel yenye hapa kuna danger? There's something coming up. Labda umetoka au umeingia mjini something ika happen and you really felt uh, insecure. Unaweza tuambie like your worst situation since yes. once kazi. In fact I was home. Hata sikuwa kwa streets. I was home and then my son was coming from school. Then there is someone I actually exposed and I to a true key. And then Truke ikakuwa nime nimecha juzi juzi tu. Yes, nimechafua mbaya sana. So Truke decided to pay back. And now to pay back, anajua mi, mi personally hawezi. But akajua huu msiku na pale naweza mfinya and that was my son. Juu mtu hii pale shule ya shule iko ni kama tuseme tuseme 100 yards away from my my home. So naka, mtu hii anatembeaga tu go to school come back, go to school come back. Sasa kuna siku mtu yeye ame akirana mehema sana nilikuwa chini ile mwembe yangu si mnajua mm -hmm. eh nashindwa na ujui imekuwa season ya maembe sasa zile nampatia maembe mtu yule ananiambia eh baba rafiki yako kuna mtu amesema rafiki yako alikuwa anataka kunipati atinipande kwa gari anilete home nikakataa nikamuliza kwa nini nikakataa teacher alisema tusikuwa tunaingia kwa gari za strangers mm -hmm. nikamuliza rafiki yangu ushaimuona hapa hapana alikuwa na gari eh yeah. gari gani gari ya black unajua gari ya black uweze <laughs> sema tick specific mm. so nikamuuliza gari ya black na kaja akaniambia gari ya black kubwa iko na kitu ya white hapa hivi sasa nikashindwa gari ya black kubwa iko na kitu ya white hapa hivi nikachukua noa nikachukua extra nikachukua nikachukua nini kiviate za black zote kutoka tu kwa mm. okay. kuonyesha hivi mtu hii ananiambia ni hii ni hii akaniguzia extra. Nikamuuliza sio hii nyingine? Sio hii. Hebu ana hizi nyingine. Hapana, baba ni hii. Nikasikia. Eh. Okay, nikamuuliza huyo mtu alikuwa anakuambia ukuje. Huyo ndere, alikuwa anaendesha gari eh, anakaa aje. Nimeupe, akona sijui amenyoa nyole kidogo huku na akona mwanya. Kuna video mzee sana ya ya Truke. Alikuwa ameka kama shots. So mimi nikasema, "Ebu, jumza <laughs> describe mse mwenye na shuku. Ebu ni muonyeshe mtu." Nikamuuliza, "Ni mtu?" Kaniambia, "Eh, Uyu. Uwi. Hiyo siku niliingia maji. Kusema ukweli sijawahi ingia maji hivyo. Kwa sababu uni mtu na usiki kabisa kwa exposes zangu na hata juu what uh, what that does for for a living. Mm -hmm. Yana jua tu amepelekwa shule, anapendwa na mzazi. Kitu kingine yote baba anapendwa na chukiwa, hiyo mtu ya juu. Hiyo yes, ndio kitu liniingiza maji mbaya. Hadi nikaamua sasa huu mse ame amekam so much personal. So upon me telling Kenyans and proving that this is not a joke, aya that is why Tito. I know why Tito. Yeah, that is why Tito. Ah, uh, uh, shaya. 
Mm. Anyway, uh -huh. so wakati nilisema, that is when people came up and then uh, actually nika kwa approached. First of all, ni chief ali come. Sabu, kwetu kukwa na very serious uh, nyumba kumi. Ndoma na mnaona, ni ngumu sana ni ya mepali. Mm. Kuna serious nyumba kumi, alafu ma cameras ni, ni lazima kwa yole ni yetu. Hizi CCTV cameras. Mm. So getting messages of the vehicle that actually my son suspected, it was just a finger on the... I had just to alert people. Then later on, yo, nikaitua kwa police station yetu, iko kaoskari. Mm. Kaitua uko, nikaelezea ile kitu nye wameona. Nikawambia, ikandikisha ma statement and stuff. Then from there, ndio pia katokea. Sitaki kusema ikampuni, but ni kampuni ambayo any private events, watakuwa na, wanakuja na maino, nini zao, ma... Then it was badges and uniform there. They are uniforms. When I could show that they are the ones protecting me. Mm -hmm. And of course, my kids are here at Kobasi. Don't you think I'm going to go to the hospital? I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. Juni home, Basi. School. Home, Basi. In a boss, I'm going to get it. Now, maybe, I don't know whether action was taken against uh, the suspect. Yeah, the investigations are going on because the cases of kidnapping is not something you just say today and then tomorrow somebody's arraigned in court. So, and then again, this same same person has acted about kidnapping of his wife. So, scenario, and then it became a huge matter. So, yeah, it's under investigation. Na mimi hata sitaki kuharakisha. Kikubwa ni kwamba ni kona security, family yangu kona security, na sio ati ni kona yo maganji. Ni wasetu wame come through and I, I really appreciate each and every individual involved in this. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. Wow. Well, quite a story. You know, it's quite a job. But anyway, to inge kwa masola mboa wiko ya kitrend hapa hivi ama kule kwenye mitendao. Na nilieza kuona in a couple of uh, videos and also blogs. Watu anasema wanangoja sana kusikia sauti ya truth watchdog. We <laughs> also what happened juicy. Yes. Yes, uh Willie Paul uh, posted something akaweza kusema kwamba kuna mapoli, kuna polisi kule nyumbani kwake and uh kwamba aliambiwa eti amegonga mtu akatoroka. I think na gari of course. Uh lakini baadaye baada ya kukamatwa akafika pale hivyo kwenye police station tukaweza kumuona bahati msani. So this is a case ambayo labda ilikuwa imejitokeza 2 years ago. There was the rape story, there was cyberbullying, and the cyberbullying is what they are dealing with right now. Umeza kuona true? Yeah, nimeza kuona hivi vitu vyote. Mm -hmm. Na kwanza ni advice ndugu yangu wili Paul. Mm -hmm. Please be very careful. Ini Kenya, be very careful when you are dragging the men in uniform. Kama huyuko shua kitu na bonga. Mm -hmm. Awa see, hata bila kukushika, waneza kakusumbua mbaya sana. Na any Kenya niko shua manyana wacha hapa. Mwenye me experience what happens when you actually say the truth about these people. Mm -hmm. Kama mleono ode malibi wa 300,000, ule wa gulf, mm -hmm. akakuja polisi tena maofisa waka mtoka. Unona venya watu wanamombia po chini? Mm -hmm. E utamahandu wa sasa, ukifanya nini, utawawa, nini, nini, nini. Because these things do happen in Kenya. You need to be very careful falsely accusing the men in uniform. Mm -hmm. They will take advantage of that. And then on a number plate ya wili poli kwa kila mahali. I think we may notice that. Mm -hmm. Gari yake pie kwa kila mahali. So uni mse mwenye atachukuliwa advantage ya pende ya sipende. He needs to be very careful about accusation wanataka kuniuwa. Because wata, kwanza watajifanya wazuri, eh, kujo tuambie, sisi to investigate, ni mapolisi gani hawa, wana adabu, wanataka kukuhua. We una police specific, auna namba ya huyo polisi, lakini unasema hawa watu wako hapa wanataka kutuhua. If those police officers decide to take action, remember that is, a, that is an institution. Individually, casing against an institution. Gori. Tafadhali, mutatusamea. Ni mutu wanduthi. Ni mutu wanduthi. So, going that direction, aneza kuwa, aneza kuwa, yani aneza jiumiza kimsani, na hata kimaisha hake personally. These guys can, trust me, I work with them, these guys can do you wrong. Umenele? Then, hapa kwa, kwa sasa rape, Ile yote tunajua ni stories za jaba. Rape na ni stories za jaba. Because if you are raped, for sure, you don't come and report it on media. Diana Marwa... Not immediately also. No, even if not immediately. Diana Marwa, what is the first thing you're supposed to do as a woman? Go to the hospital. Huh? First go to the hospital. Then from there you are advised to go to the police station de, uh, and write a statement, take a P3, something of sort. Yeah. Right? Akona mm -hmm. Akona ini, 
documents that could show how flani after this happened? Uh, we're not sure whether maybe they are go how they are going to handle this case because while Isema, it's like they are going to first deal with cyberbullying, then Wendele. That's what uh, the lawyer said. Then Wendele na hiyengine ya rape case. Now I think what they were uh, mini, um, solving right now was the issue of cyberbullying. They haven't solved because actually during the hearing, uh, the side or uh, the accusers did not show up. You know, and that is a very bad picture, because if if I'm a complainant that you've done me something wrong, mm -hmm. the moment I get that opportunity, remember courts ni vitu zinakuwa fully loaded na cases. Kuna msemo nyako apa kwa yuko courti semi nyo meitu wa kuna pata akona ngapi akona miaka kama tatu kesi yake jawai kutatuliwa. So oki pata yu opportunity as the accuser or complainant na kuambia wezi miss ata unaza kama pema kuliko the judges. Nalewa. So how oku miss it only indicates one thing. Either it is just a, you know, ile kiki ya wasani, one. Number two, could be that Will Paul is trying to sort out issues na baha in jia court. Unaget? The thing is, I got there at around uh, a minute to 9 a.m. And uh, pale nilipofika nilieza kupatana na lawyer wa Diana Bahati na pia manager wa Bahati. So I don't know whether like it was intentionally... Like he case, wali, wali kosa ku attend intentionally, we are not sure. Like he lawyer alikuwa pale, manager alikuwa pale. Then they should have represented them. Why didn't the case go ahead? Yeah? You know, so I think wa Kenya wengi wamekua kiuliza sababu na jua wengi wameacho kwenye mata. What really happened? Because sometime, uh, I, I don't think this is very serious. By the way, unajua yu mchezo ya Willi Paul, ni mchezo ina happen kila mahale. Unaget? Ni mchezo ina happen na wasani wengi sana. Juzi si miona zuchu wa miachana na diamond. Eh, si juu le zari ya miachana ule msi. Then of a sudden what happened? Diamond akamomba msamaha zuchu. Exactly. And they, they, are, they are back. So some of these vitukos do happen. Mimi nikiona a song. Hata sita shitukati. Oh my god. So ilikuwa ni song. Is it possible for us to... Very. Very. Wasanini wasanitu? Bahati featuring Willi Paul. Recently Willi Paul ali, ali pull nini? Si ali pull kuna aswa mekam na magani kwa ke. Alenda ka report. We watu wakuje kwa kwa round nyumba wako na magan. Waingie mbaka ndani wataka kushoot. Alafu you do a video, post it on media. I think now, uh, kuna, kuna mali wa Kenya. Because at first, actually, Kenyans thought it was a stunt. It was cloud chasing. Lakini, imefikia mali hadi wili Paul. Alifua kuwa na show Australia this month. Mm -hmm. But, kiangalia zile uh, posters ame archive kwenye Instagram. Like, they are no longer there. Do you think... At some point, because I saw some Kenyans saying, oh, uh, maybe Bahati Ataki Kona will pull a Kenya to perform Pali for Australia. Vitu kama hizo. Eh, kami mifikayo level, I'm not sure. Uh, kami mifikayo level, eh, 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 that is wrong. That is very wrong from the side of Baha. Uh, you're not supposed to go, to stoop that low. Yeah, these arguments, these are kukosana, hizo kukosawa. Lakini mkate wa mtu simzuye. Sabu at the end of the day, wili pull a jitegemei. Kuna watu wana mtegemei. Nilisikia kisema ini mzazi. Okay, so probably that is true, he's a parent. And uh, kuna ule mamake pia shai mtajataja mara nyingi, kwamba mamake ndo yuko. Mm -hmm. So, kuna watu wana mtegemea. So, ku, kukata, kukataza mtaji wa mtu, mm -hmm. na aibi ni hasole yake, ayo ngori. Mm -hmm. Una get? Mm -hmm. So, that one I really di, uh, disagree and uh, uh, disapprove of such kind of behavior. Mm -hmm. Una get? Mm -hmm. Nato kijaribu kufungia mtu, like, asipate gigs zake. I don't think uta do that for long. Uh, over time, was not to realize when him say in a gani. And trust me, your own fans will fry you. Una get? So that is not the right way to to solve issues. We ukamu me kosa na mimi na umemu a kesi yende mbele sort na mimi. Usi kujia ku damage mbaka usi anawangu na makampuni zangu. Haista hili, haista hili kabisa. So si juu kabisa kama anaduivo, but probably na zako iko cancelled due to other issues. So abupia si chance si alikuwa kam Kenya. Then kwa kwa na disagreement ya one, two, three, aka cancel. So it's normal for wasani ku cancel events, but I'm not sure whether it's Baha behind cancellation ya nani. Yeah, ya Willi Paul. Events za Willi Paul. Now maybe um, on this, because ilikulikuwa na a lot of drama two years ago when Diana Bahati first did this video. Tuleza kumaona alikuwa na Lia and things like that. Do you think it's a way, uh, it's a good way or it's a good thing for Kenyan artists and celebrities to do that is expose and roast each other online? Because 
sincerely that video was quite sensitive and uh, they say at some point probably career ya Pose ilikuanga affected especially uh, with the brands that uh, he used to work with. Uh, Sometimes they go they go solo. Sometimes it's immature, very mature. Yeah? And uh, you wonder, kwani ya wasi, apart from entertaining, ama ili akili ya kuandika mziki na kutu entertain, hawana akili ya kufikiria. Unawana? Kwa sababu kuna vitu vingine ukifanya, by the way, you need to really be considerate. Shiko wachani kuambie, unawana mtu wana expose mse, I make sure, hau siki kabisa kwa hilo jamba wana expose. Lakini kama in one way or another, you are connected to this thing. Not that uh, no, uh, only that you are not directed you are not directly connected to it please be very careful unaona <coughs> because kuna vitu zenye unaweza fikiria huyu msee ana against you kumbe yako nazo ama hata kama ana wase flani wenye wako nazo wanaka realize eh umeko na huyu msee na huyu msee yuko that guilty wanakuja na dunini wanapati huyu msee hizo vitu una get be very careful so you could stoop that law it's not proper for me i feel so embarrassed like wale wase nye kioja jamii tuna tunaangalia kama kioja jamii wale wa, 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 wa wasani uh, chipukizi wana kama wanapata indio tabia ya mtu fulani it's 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 not good uh -huh. it's not good at all and they need to really like a mature rap all of them uh -huh. yani tu unaambia tu mse ukweli eh hey bro hapa na umechoma grow uh -huh. grow just be mature here unajua, unajua uh, differences ama hii beef ya pose na bahati ilianza kitambo i think it's now over 10 years for me, I consider them as siblings. My siblings don't pick up for what are you going to be? Lakini me take long. Siblings Mona, at least mna kosana mna rudia. Mona baha jai pick one am tumgine. Mona will pull a jai pick one am tumgine. Mm -hmm. These are more of brothers. Ona get? Yani kila msa na taka kuchiki tu. Eh, baha me fanya nini? Mm -hmm. Baha me fikisha one million view, one million subscribers. Eh, eh. Pose ya ko. Pose ya Ona get? Mm -hmm. And then you utapata pia ni ma fan base ya Willie Paul na baha. Wana waskuma iyo kugonga na ku to make sure that actually they remain relevant in the game. Uh -huh. So unaweza pata baha sipo asipogonga wili Paul. Unapata baha ameshuka. Wili Paul asipogonga baha. Wili Paul ameshuka, una get. So sometime you need to find a, a rival. Ni kama tu kwa siasa like say uh Ruto ali identify a proper rival ndio yeye akwe president. Mm -hmm. And get after mtu maybe Ruto angesimama against Kashagwa, what are we angle lose? Mm -hmm. Una get. But I'll have to identify Raila Odinga. Mm -hmm. Then make sure I'm a bonga now as they were If we could buy them, if we could whatever they have to do, make sure we get what we can make. So that the level of the level is mega one. Moses Kuria, Kamia, Kujeni, ni boost. So we will pull our identify. My only rival. Now my two members are almost the same. Ni Baha. Now Baha can identify. So that's why they have to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth for the better of the game. But I hope it doesn't get that personal. What advice would you give Willie Paul? Pose uzikuwe mtu wa kusharekea kwanza, araka. Of course, after the court, uliona amenda pale, kurukaruka, kufanya zile madance moves zake. Uzikuwe mtu wa, wa araka sana kuselebrate. Celebrating that quick, trust me, nazakuwa ni kaa kwiki. Na mwaga araka, the moment you realize ume mwaga araka, bro, demo ame kutoka, jiwa naona una job. So you need to be very careful. Uh, if the case is serious, please give it that seriousness. In fact, be very serious more than the case. Uh -huh. Usishereke tu kufanya mchezo mchezo hapa ati niko sawa, things will be handled, ah wapi wapi wapi. Unless ni songi nakam sawa, lakini kama ni kitu serious, don't celebrate that quick. To Diana and Bahati. Diana and Bahati, kwanza uh, Diana, asira usia ileta media. I media siya mamako, siya babako. Utakasirika, bado umafala, watongea tu venya watongea. Utajaribu kufanya the very best of yourself. Utajaribu kubehave na mafans. Still they will treat you with the same same way they will treat you when you do bad things. Mm -hmm. So for me is a as well letter emotions ama my feelings. Unaona kama hizo vitu zake ana rapingi. Anafatu ku maintain hizo. Juu hizo ndio wasa na watch. Alafu kuna zile vitu bro songa bana. Songa kwa barabara. Ni aje? Freshi. Kuna zile vitu za Kuna zile ma rap yao do, kuna zile video zenye wao do za keja. No, no, chikizi propel sana. That is the energy and I focus on. Wanna get? Ima mbo ingina, yo, she wrapped me. And then, and I fikiri aje machozi. What's that? Shiko, ukire piwa, always fikiri ya. Story in a flow bila kufikiri ya kitu nafaku sema. Wanna get? Sasa yo venya, likuwa nafikiri ya. And then, and then, akwerra. What's that drama nyingi? Wanna lewa? Then Baha, 
baba sijui nitamwambia nini mtoto wa mama mimi mm. ndakwambia hivi sasa hiyo si mtoto wa mama buda we ni baba changamka vitu kama hizi sometimes you don't get personal yes kunaweza kuwa na hiyo disrespect but sometimes just uh, mwanaume akikataa kusikiza that is the only time utahitaji kumpinch kidogo mm. but isikuwe ni mnafikia mahali mpaka kutaka kuharibiana careers kuharibiana majina uh, haistahili kabisa so they need to actually they need to treat it as a, as a civil case just sort out the issues because at the end of the day the two of them are brands and they need to take care of each other at the end of the day kesho upendo sipende niko sure will pola kakufa saa hii mtu atalia the most ni da, ni baha baha ka disappear mtu ataumia sana ni will pola because their coexistence uh -huh. is actually making them vibrant on media so baha same mwenzako uh -huh. kama kuna hiyo makosa will pola nawe pia acha kurukia rukia maneno uh -huh. kama kitu ujui wacha kusema ati wamekuja kuniua mchana watu wanakuja kukuua uh -huh. kwa Yeah. All right now as we wind up one last question the last time we were with you to got um whatever happened between Trevor and Mungai Eve yes later on i think two days after we did the interview to leza kuona mungai eve aliweza kufungua channel yake actually yeah. right now as we speak i think i almost could hit 100k subscribers mm -hmm. uh -huh. yeah mina na freya sana by the way mm -hmm. if uh, if this is the backup channel mm -hmm. and that was a strategy it's very good it's working Is it possible it could be a backup channel? Kama mnasema my feelings iko involved. Mbona mbona venye Trevor na post hivi mungai? Ama you guys are Actually ali congratulate. Yeah, pia kwa channel yake stories concerning mungai. Alafu Wewe nakwambia mimi ukinikosea na nilikuwa na my feelings. Ah yendo ka postiwa na nyanya yako. Why? Me I'm telling you these guys Wewe chukua my feelings hapo eh hey, if mungai very good you've opened your channel that Trevor guy is a bad guy. Mambo ya watu wawili. Stay away. Mm -hmm. Ogopa. Imagine tu ya if mungaya anaangalia tu zile comments anamwambia, "Eh hey, babe, niaje?" But they don't even come. Umeona venye kanaenda poa? Aki kanaenda poa. Uh -huh. Be very careful. Be very careful. Alafu unachukia hata mademo mwenye demo mwenye ameonekana na Trevor. Mm -hmm. Ana flaunt. Not not it's not private. It's public. Mm -hmm. Anakuja tu, "Eh hey, demo wangu, eh hey, same. My bloggers kawaida yenu." Chike chike chike. Yeah, wa wa. Ini game bro. Ini mnachezwa. I mean I believe mnachezwa mbaya sana. Uh -huh. There is no way. Uh -huh. Mimi nakwambia emotions. Mm -hmm. Poza na bro, koje? Umegotewa. Ani ma DCI. So ndio 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 ati nikupost after umenifanya venye umenifanya. Nikupata na mwanaume alafu mimi nikupost. Ah. Ona cheza ni niyo tangoja sana. Acha tungoje labda tone ya taishia vipi. Anyway, uh, true the santi sana kwa okay. muda wako. Lakini kabla of course atuja kurusu wende wape kwenye mitenda wa kupate wapi kwa yule ambaye aja kufuatilia. Okay, kwa yule ambaye aja nifuatalia na napenda ukweli, mm. ma reality. Mm -hmm. Follow TWD mm -hmm. official on media, mm -hmm. subscribe pale hit ma notification. Mm -hmm. Na kama unapenda kaumbea kidogo, kaumbea kuna TWD media. Uh -huh. Iyo kamu kuja usikize yani nakwambia pale hivyo ni kucheka cha ingine moto served hot eh hey, ile ni moto sukari uh -huh. ni enough uh -huh. lakini kama uko na diabetes bia tuna consider yako iko unaelewa uh -huh. hey, everyone please come subscribe to TWD official TWD media uh -huh. tunaendelea kuwaleta uhondo kila siku uh -huh. and making sure we don't repeat ourselves Right, right there you have heard it yourself from uh, to the watchdog. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to follow him Palivo on YouTube and Columbia TWD official. Make sure you go there, subscribe, get entertained. Mambo ni mengi ya kusavua Palivo. Thank you so much. Until next time, I've been your host, Shiko Gitao on all platforms. You can find me at I underscore I'm Shiko Gitao. Thank you.